Hey everybody, I'm Trisha Swenson with a look at what's happening this weekend in the Vail Valley. And if you're still looking to play some golf, well, you can do so. Eagle Ranch closes on November 10th. That's this Sunday. And then, of course, Gypsum Creek is still open for a few more weeks. So since the slopes aren't open yet in Eagle County, you can get out there, maybe check out the links. But a few things that are happening, if the holidays and winter is on your mind, we have the Eagle Winter Market and Holiday Fair. It's gonna be this Saturday at the Eagle River Center, down in Eagle, and it's gonna have a ton of vendors all throughout the space, selling everything from jewelry and clothing and candles and art and also delicious food if you want to get a jump on some of those holiday parties and then bring the kids they're going to have kids activities for you as well face painting and santa is going to be there so your whole family can come out bring the dog bring your pets take a picture with santa and you'll be good to go for the holiday season and get some shopping done for everybody on your list now, a few other things happening this weekend. We have some great youth performances. The Homestake Peak School has been busy with their production of Peter Pan Jr. And this is going to be on Friday and Saturday night at the Home Homestake Peak School Auditorium. 6.30 p.m. Come early. Doors open at 6. And their famous bake sale is going to be going on from that time. And that helps fund the Homestake Peak Drama Club. So 27 students from third through eighth grade are gonna be putting together this show. So it should be just a, a great family entertainment. And then the Vail Performing Arts Academy, they're celebrating 30 years of performances and they're gonna be doing a whole review from all of their different years. This will be at the Villar Performing Arts Center. This is where they performed their first production, Grease, 30 years ago. So their shows are going to be Saturday and Sunday at the Villar at 6.30 p.m. So you can go to their website, bpaa.org, to get some details and get your tickets for that. Now, other things, comedy. We've got some comedy happening down at Moe's Original Barbecue in Eagle. It is the Vail Comedy Show returning, and it's going to be Rahman Hirschberg, and he is out of New York City, originally from Kentucky, but he is just exploding on the scene of comedy. He's been on the, the Tonight Show with Jimmy Fallon. He's also been in the Late Late Show with James Corden, Comedy Central. So that'll be on Friday night if you're looking for some laughs. And then the Vail Nordic Swap is going on this weekend too. So if you're looking to get some classic cross country or skate gear, snowshoes, AT gear, Ski and Snowboard Club Vail does this every year. It's a great benefit for them and their student athletes, but it's held at the Vail Nordic Center. Nordic Center, not quite open for trails, but their shop is open. And on Saturday from 10 until one, they're gonna be having their annual swap. So get into a new sport at a discount. If you have some old equipment to sell, you can do that too. So just contact the Ski and Snowboard Club Vail for more details if you wanna sell your gear. And then we've got a book talk at Colorado Snow Sports Museum. It's called Ski Climb Fight. And this is a great historical account of the origins of the 10th Mountain Division, how it started all those years ago and what it's doing in modern times. So if you want to go there, this is from two to four on Sunday at the Colorado Snow Sports Museum. It's absolutely free. For more information, you can go to the Colorado Snow Sports Museum's website to get some details. But once again, hey, if you can't go skiing yet, maybe do a little golf this weekend. And don't forget, you can still buy your Epic Pass. The price does go up on November 17th. So if you still need to purchase that, go to epicpass.com.